Do you even remember why most people stopped using plain React.js and started using Next.js instead? Well, there were many reasons to that for sure, but for many people, myself included, faster page loading, pre-rendered pages in the server, and more control over the SEO part of the app were enough reasons to make the change. I mean, we all know that SEO stands for Search Engine Optimization. And at the end of the day, all we want is to make our web applications more visible to search engines, especially Google, but not only, so we can build and grow the organic traffic inside our websites. This playlist that I'm starting in this video will cover some of the most relevant topics when it comes to Next.js SEO. I decided to split this information into several short videos so you can test this knowledge yourself, check the source code, after watching each tutorial. Let's check the project that we will use to build up our SEO skills. This is a simple Next.js project that fetches data from an external API. This will give us access to dynamic data coming from the server. Forget about this horrible UI in this project because we will not cover that at all, but I will give you full access to the start code that you can see on the screen, so you can check all of this on your own. Building the SEO is all that really matters in this project. What is search engine optimization anyway? In simple words, it's the process of improving your web application to increase its visibility inside all of the search engines. Search crawlers look for information and they like content that is organized and visible to them. That's why we will create the sitemap and robots files later in this playlist. They are good practices that will help the indexing and ranking of a web page. Basically, if you follow all of the good practices, you get a better chance of ranking your app higher on Google and other search engines too. And these good practices are exactly what I'm going to be showing you in these videos. If you watch all of the upcoming videos in this playlist and practice what I will be teaching you, you will learn all of the 2024 SEO essentials in Next.js. Now that I introduced you to SEO and showed you the project, it is time to go from theory to practice. And we are going to start by playing with this metadata. So let's do this.